Welcome, this is just a little video to help you know what to expect when you're able to come to church. We're really looking forward to being able to welcome people to come back into the church building for our church services. And I just want to take you through how things will be when we're able to start that on August the 2nd with a 9.30 service. First of all, as you arrive, as you come up the path from the Lich Gate, um, we, we do ask that as you walk your way up, you make sure that you queue keeping in mind the social distancing of two metres. And then as you approach the north door, um, there will be one of the wardens standing outside and they will let you know when it is okay to come in. So if you'd like now to come in with me. We'll have the double doors open um, so there's no congestion actually at the door. And then when you come in, The first thing you'll see, which is different, is the uh, hand gel. So we'd ask that you stop here, sanitise your hands uh, for 20 seconds. And then there's a little uh, label here, which just gives some guidance about where you can sit um, on, the, on the various seats in the church. There'll be another warden inside, and they'll be able to show you where it's possible to sit. Uh, unfortunately, we can't guarantee that you'll be able to sit in the places that you normally do because we've got to organise things around the social distancing. So if you come with me, you'll see that the pews will have uh, labels on. Uh, this one here says sit here. So that's free for you to sit on. Uh, the next one here says do not sit here. So you can't sit on that one. And then the next one, sit here. And if we come round to this side... Um, if I was to have uh, sat down the end here, um, my, my family, because they're my household, can sit with me on this pew. But that would mean that somebody two metres away couldn't sit at this end if my family was already on this pew, because that would breach the social distancing. Now you notice that in church there's, there's none of the Bibles that we normally have here, so we do ask that you bring your Bible. And in terms of the actual service, um, uh, I'll be leading it from here. And the service, what we'll be having is, um, we'll be having some psalms. We can read a psalm together to praise God. We won't be able to sing yet, um, but we'll have uh, the Bible being read. We'll have a short talk. We'll have time of prayers. And at this initial opening stage, we're not planning to have communion services either. And so it'd be good to be together. We reckon we can fit a fairly good number, sort of 60 or so, in the church with social distancing together to worship Jesus and learn more about him. Now, at the end of the service, we ask you to remain seated in the pews and then, uh, row by row, the wardens will invite you to leave. And to leave, we ask that you come th out through the south porch which is down this side. And again, as you leave, there's a hand gel here so you can sanitise your hands on your way out. And then leave via the south porch. And we do ask that um, after the service, well, the government has asked that we don't use the churchyard as a place for multiple households to uh, assemble and get together because that would run the risk of spreading infection. So we do ask that at the end of the service, uh, you disperse promptly uh, from, from, the, from the church building. So we really look forward to welcoming you back to church for a service actually to take place in church. We've done all the risk assessments that the government has asked us to do and made the place as safe as we possibly can do. And it should be really good uh, to be able to meet in this way as our first step towards being able to reopen the church and assemble as we were used to.